Welcome back to part two of our technical tour of this Olstein 719R offshore standby vessel. It's an emergency rescue vessel and we're going to be uh, taking a tour through the engine room and the systems with the chief engineer Mario who is very knowledgeable and justifiably proud of one of the cleanest and best managed engine rooms I've ever seen on a yacht or a commercial vessel. Uh, diesel generator, yeah, this is uh, one diesel generator, harbor generator of what we have on the... It's very good condition, yeah. We, we not have any issues with this generator. Always running and only the port, yeah. And this is Volvo. Yes, Volvo Penta. Quite good model, yeah. Yeah. yeah all uh, the manuals, yeah. What we have after this Norwegian crew, yeah. All drawings. Here we have this uh, uh, harbor generator, yeah. Shaft generator number one, my engine, and shaft generator number two. This is hydraulic units. Uh, if you look here, for cargo fuel pumps, yeah for cargo pump, a, de a deck and a tugger winch, yeah? All hydraulic what we have. The starboard my engine, starboard shaft generator, reduction gear. We always keep this clean and make maintenance, uh, follow the instruction from T-Master, yeah? All details uh, and the main engine you have also here, yeah? Quite good engine. <laughs> Very brave. Oh, right. <laughs> so these engines have been good for you. Yes. Oh, we tested last time. Yeah. This is seawater pumps. Yeah. Uh, this is number two, number one, and this is emergency. Yeah. The ballast pump. It's nice system. Yeah, because if this pump fail and this uh, emergency one and the forward yeah still we can use the ballast like fire yeah we just we open this valve and yeah. we have yeah. supply for fire line yeah this is fresh water transfer pump yeah we also last time we pumping about 300 300 uh, tons water yeah out yeah this is uh, like CO2 bottles. This is not CO2, this is halon, yeah? Old system, yeah? Aha. Uh -huh. Fuel oil purifier. Good company, I think. Yes. My favorite. Okay. Alpha Laval, the best <laughs> in the world. <laughs> this is loop oil filter and heater, yeah? Mm. Now it's off because we save power. Because this Jenny is not enough for <laughs> everything. It is quite new fuel sounding system, yeah? Okay, we're going to pump room, pumping room. So this is a huge space here. Yeah, a lot of space. This is fuel oil, fuel oil yeah, cargo pump, yeah? Very strong pump, yeah? All right. And here is uh, pumps, hydraulic pump. Every, every one is hydraulic, yeah? All it's right. Not, uh, not either needed. So for uh, our purposes, we don't need any of this? No. So we could clear out this entire oil. space. And cut this pipe, yeah, because this is everything from from mud tank, yeah. Yeah, this yeah. Is, this is transfer pump to to mud tank. This is bilge manifold. This is uh, ballast water manifold, yeah. My tanks are above us. Yeah, above. Also can cut, and you have a lot of space. Yeah. Huge. We can check in the drawings how big is. And it's huge. Okay, this is stern thruster. So on either side of us here are... This is ballast. Ballast. Sorry. It was tested by Forster, yeah? Last time. A few days ago. Okay, well, we, we can go to cement room, yeah? Also the coolers, yeah? It's loop oil. Seawater, seawater, blue boy. Yeah, two, two loop oil, two seawater coolers. Yeah. This is clean power. We call clean power because we have 60 hertz yeah. on board. Yeah. This is make some some devices is working for 50. Yeah. 
That's why we have like purifier is uh, working for 50 Hz, yeah? Okay. It's cement rooms, three cement, huge tanks. It's a lot of space here. We can also go in down and look. Yeah, they go down at least yeah. like another deck and a half. Yes, this is a lot of space. Can make a good swimming pool here. Yeah, no, a big jacuzzi, I think. <laughs> you can have a hot one, medium, and ice. We going down? Sure. Okay. Emergency fire pump, yeah. It's tested every week. It was also tested last time with the port state. Everything working fine. Three hydro for pumps, yeah. We use so we are Probably three and a half meters or more. This is 200, 200 250 centimeters about there. Yeah? Uh, 400. Oh, this will be three and a half. And both raster, yeah? Also working good. Mariusz Burkacki, Chief Engineer, Atlantic Offshore. And, and where are you from, Mario? Yeah, I'm from Hell, just one L, yeah, from Poland. Small city, yeah? yeah. North of Poland. Very yeah. nice summer time. And how, how long have you been on this boat? Oh, three years. So, uh, I started this company from the 2013. How do you like the boat? Very nice boat. Brave boat, yeah? Brave. La last, last time is proof, yeah? Because it was 80, 80 knots almost. Uh, almost showing the bridge, yeah? 80 knots. But you were, you were comfortable in here? Yeah, very nice. And many thanks to Mario from the Yacht Channel for a great tour of the engine room and the system spaces on this Ulstein 719R in Bergen, Norway. Uh, we hope you enjoyed the, this two-part technical tour of this uh, standby vessel, and we look forward to bringing you more vessels in the future.